And so the Duke's reign in Sukonos came to an abrupt end, with the old order burned to the ground. Times were hard, and the people left in the rubble had no choice but to claw and fight for every last scrap. And so the Duke fell, and in his place arose a figure from the underworld. Paolo had come into the world with nothing, but was determined to leave it a very rich man. Sometimes power shouts, and sometimes it whispers. And so a man born with the face of the Duke took his seat in Karnaka, ruling with empathy for those not born in a palace. The people were surprised by this sudden turn, but did not question their good fortune. With the fall of Luca Abel, the Duke's line ended, and there was only one man suited for the Grand Palace. Rising up from nothing, he had served the Empire with distinction. Duke Corvo Atano, the first of his line. After facing a powerful supernatural enemy, the Empress and her royal protector saw a ferocious ally in the Abbey of the Everyman, who at long last began to enforce unrestrained righteousness across Sirkonos. With the fall of Luca Abel, the Duke's line ended, and there was only one man ruthless enough to take the Grand Palace. Fighting his way up from nothing, none of his enemies were around to oppose the bloody Duke, Corvo Atano. In Dunwall, with the death of Delilah Copperspoon, her cover lost its power and was smashed. The disastrous coup brought to an end. The rightful Empress once again seized her throne. And so it was that Emily the Vengeful rooted out the last of those who had betrayed her and ruled over her empire with her legendary father, Corvo Atano, standing by her side. In Dunwall, without ever realizing it, Delilah passed into an imagined world where her father's promises were fulfilled and her subjects would love her forever as she sailed the ocean with a great fleet and trekked across the Pendicean wastes. While in the true capital, Emily the Just, Emily the Clever, ruled for decades over a prosperous, mended empire with Corvo Atano by her side. In Dunwall, with the death of Delilah Copperspoon, her coven lost its power and was smashed. Their disastrous coup brought to an end. And thus, a new emperor arose in the capital, as Corvo the Black seized the empire and hunted down his enemies, with his precious daughter safe behind his throne for all time. In Dunwall, with the death of Delilah Copperspoon, her coven lost its power and was smashed. Their disastrous coup brought to an end by the true Empress. And thus, Emily the Butcher took back her empire and executed her enemies, her father standing in silence beside her throne for all her years and beyond. Dunwall, with the death of Delilah Copperspoon, her coven lost its power, and their short-lived coup came to an end. The rightful Empress returned to the throne and began extinguishing the fires across her city. So it was that Emily the Just, Emily the Clever, would fulfill her destiny, ruling for decades over a mended empire, with Corvo Atano's support from the south. In Dunwall, with the death of Delilah Copperspoon, her coven lost its power and was smashed. Their disastrous coup brought to an end. 
the rightful empress once again seized her throne. And so it was that Emily the Vengeful rooted out the last of those who had betrayed her and ruled over her empire with the support of her legendary father, Corvo Otano, from the south. In his day, Anton Sokolov fired the engines of industry, hurling the empire into a more sophisticated age. He dallied with nobles, wayward artists, and great inventors alike, drinking in all that life could offer. Leaving Dunwall for the last time, he headed to the cold north, contented at last on a final voyage to take him home. In his day, Anton Sokolov lit the fires of industry, starting a great consuming blaze at the heart of the empire. He saw his machines used for war and oppression, watching the powerful crush those beneath them. Leaving Dunwall for the last time, he turned to the cold north, his energy spent at last, only an echo of the man he'd aspired to be. There are things that never change, no matter how hard you try, questions you must answer. As Megan Foster faded from the world, Billy Lurk stepped from her shadow, setting out to discover her truest self and seeking the closest thing she'd ever known to family.